Hey guys, Ahmad Rizvi here. Today we are going to see how to be safe while surfing on the internet. Without any further delay, let's get right into it. First and foremost, one should always read cookie disclaimers. For example, if you happen to go to lego.com, then you will be greeted by this message. In a nutshell, Lego says that they need certain cookies to improve the time spent by user on website. Other cookies are used for marketing purposes. As a rule of thumb, you should turn off cookies used for marketing purposes, since it stores very sensitive information and it does not affect the overall experience of the website. Moving on, let's look at the cookie settings at Google Chrome. To see the settings, we will type this URL into Google search bar. Done? Good. Now let's check mark the option to block third party cookies. By doing this, the sites you visit cannot personalize ads. Congratulations. You have now successfully dealt with cookies. With that out of the way, let's move on to password protection on your social media. First things first, never, ever, share your password to anyone. Period. Then, choose a strong password which is easy to remember. You would be questioning yourself as to how to keep a strong password. Fear not, viewers. I am here. For this, you should use one capital letter, one number, and one small letter. Your password should also contain at least 8 characters. Now that we have seen how to have the best settings for cookies and passwords, it is time to look at the final security measure to safeguard you whenever you are online. You should enable two-step authorization. In two-step authorization, once you type in your password, the website will send an OTP to your phone. After entering the OTP, you would gain access to your account. The advantage of using this feature is that hackers cannot hack your account by just knowing your password. They would have to have access to your phone also. That's all for today, folks. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that like button, and subscribe. Bye guys.